Good morning, everybody. My name is Apollo, and welcome to a game called What Never Was. So I was just scrolling around Steam, and I found this. And it looked really interesting, so I just was like, Alright, I want to play it. Also, I want to just make sure subtitles are on, and I'm just going to turn it up just a little bit more. I was playing a game that hey, was... Mom, where are you? Wait, what? So you're not coming? But I'm already here. I know, but Mom, don't we owe it to Grandpa to... Yeah, I know, it's just... What? You can't sell the clock? Grandpa's had that for years. Okay, okay, whatever, it's fine. I can just start clearing out my boxes and then... I don't know. We can come back tomorrow and do the rest? Yeah, bye. Don't you love it when you're on the phone with your mom and all she says is I get it, that's the trope, really but like going to miss you, Grandpa. Alright. Let's do this. So I honestly know nothing about this game, alright? Honestly, know nothing. And I don't know how long this is gonna be, so this could end up being like a super long game, but I will end up just doing it all in um okay, never mind. I'll just do it all in, you know, one go, or I will take multiple times, so. Oh, Grandpa's old travel diary. Seems like a few pages. I should see if I can find the missing pages before moving this. Oh, okay, so if I right-click, left says glass. something, right-click, move something. magnifying things. Thank you. Ma'am, with your constant talking. Here's the clock you guys were talking My about. My grandfather's grandfather clock. It's locked. Grandpa loved this thing. Told me it was one of a kind. Although, he never actually told me why. A typewriter. What a globe. View sang China. And a symbol of a tree. Hey, this is that goddess thing mentioned in Grandpa's diary. It's a small, simple key. Maybe it fits the desk. Cool. Oh, right here. A tape recorder. Play it. Hello. This is Dude, is that an N64? Wright with a message for my granddaughter, Sarah Elizabeth Wright. So if anyone else is listening, they can start off immediately, please. <laughs> Shh. We're not <clears throat> listening. Shh. Sarah, if you are listening to this, then it means, well, it means I'm gone. But I don't want you to be too sad about it. That's just the way life goes sometimes. Huh. So, chin up, my little pixie. Remember our grand moments. All the adventures we had when Ugh. we were a little one. And I she is terrifying in that photo. I... I know you have questions for me. It's true I kept secrets from you and your mother. But there were good reasons. Were there? There are things in this world. Peely? Greater than ourselves. Or and I needed to protect you from them. I didn't want either of you to face the dangers that I've had to... I never wanted to place such a burden on your shoulders, but now it, hmm. it's unavoidable. I don't want to talk through like it's all of this I talking, so. Help, but I can't just tell you. I have to show you. You will need to see for yourself. All right. This world is full of secrets. From the tallest tree to the deepest river. In every breath of wind and every dancing every rain, breath of wind. all you have to do is look. Goodbye, Sarah. I love you very much. I love you too, Grandpa. Goodbye, Grandpa. Look at that, an N64. Oh, man. My old A station. Mm. I spent hours playing games on this thing. Is that a Nintendo 64? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a Nintendo 64. A gramophone? Oh, the old gramophone. Hmm. What's this? Uh, Q? Alright. 
cell phone. It's a Mattis flip phone. It's a year old, but still works pretty good. I'm not in a hurry to upgrade, even though the new smartphone looks pretty nifty. Well, maybe I'll, maybe if I could afford one. So an ID, it's my ID. Oh, that's me. Look at me, I'm a cutie. Necklace, a necklace that I got from a grandpa when I turned 10. He joked, he joked that it was magical. Yeah, magical, and that it would keep me safe from monsters and such under my bed. And I believed him for the longest time. I wore it since. I've worn it since, and now he's gone. I don't think I'll ever stop wearing it. Cassette tape, small key, journal entry. It seems no coincidence that both the resting place of Pele, or Pella, and Parquan were would happen to be in mountains. The trek was the. Trek has gone well as through the winds are ominous, my clothing and necessities have been carried for me so far. The guard I have hired upon arrival has provided invaluability has provided invaluable. Not only is in his knowledge of the thick forest, but also for his rich knowledge in his company. Not unexpectedly, the symbol of water could be found at the peak of the summit, along with the alch alchemic symbol of water. Okay. Again, these symbols seem in interconnected, while one set are alchemist symbols known to many people, the others seem strange and of no culture design, or that least I'm aware, uh, I am knowledgeable of. The encounter on Hawaii makes me certain that the other two elements must bear significance as well. What will I find on this mountain? So I'm assuming- oh, that's a really cool lighting effect. I'm assuming that I have to go through his desk, so. Is there a crouch? Okay. A desk drawer. Anything in there? An, an open desk drawer. Thank you. All right, what do we got? A pretty fancy looking compass. That's a really nice binocular. Monocular? I think it's an a... open desk drawer. Oh, isn't that great? All right. Hmm. What's this? Uh, photograph. An old photograph found in Grandpa's desk. It says, Sultan has Mascu Masera, Egypt, 1966. It must have been from one of his trips. This seems to belong to the diary. Journal number four. So I got two, now I got four. All the work... F all I've worked for, it's here. I know it. The necklace is the Temple of China. Made all the difference, and now I'm finally in Africa. Hoping to set the burning sensation of curiosity to peace, the symbols line up with my calculations were correct. Then the anonymous mail I've received helped on a grand scale, but I still have not managed to figure out the sender. Regardless, the last piece of knowledge should be in here, in Egypt. Uh, and after... Ha, ha, ha. And after having evaded my guide, I have now found the symbols. It's time. Time to learn what it's behind these strange connection events. Anything else? Nope. Okay. Um. Huh. This tin box looks fairly old and has a combination lock on it. What could the combination be? Wait, what's my name? Student ID. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. Spin around, spin around, spin around, spin... Oh my goodness! What's my name? 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 Sarah. Okay, my name is Sarah. So... S. Yeah, it's gonna be my name. A-R-A-H. And H. Okay, Grandpa. Damn. I was sure that would be it. Really? Maybe I need something else to solve this. Okay, for now, close that. We'll go through the rest of these, and then we'll come back to that. It looks like a torn out page. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Journal page number three. The alchemist symbol of Earth combined with the Chinese... One for tree. While the trip has yet again gone well, and my research has once again led me to these symbols, I can draw no conclusion. I spent most of my life researching these mythological connections, yet again I reach my destination. Yet again I reach my destination and nothing. Almost as if it's all an extremely elaborate prank. I sometimes wonder if my daughter is right. Months, nay years of planning, only to eventually find a temple or shrine with another clue, another riddle, and another clue. However, at the same time, it feels like I'm almost getting closer to something. 
Okay. So keep that one open, because I guess it's not my name. Pele, goddess of fire. I should see if I can find the missing pages be I should see if I can find the missing pages before move. Nah. I don't feel like reading up on kings. I really wish I knew if that was in tune or not. Okay, well, I guess there's one more letter around here. Cause I'm missing the first entry page, so a torn out page. Got it. Uh, I finally landed on Hawaii and will soon begin my enormous climb of Mon Mauna Lua. I'm not much of a climber, but I'm filled with determination. I will, however, f it will. I will, however, first take some days to recuperate from my very tiresome travel, from which my fear of flight did not exactly improve. Not only was the pilot rude and dismissive of safety protocol, he also seemed completely unsure at times what he was doing. Regardless, I am here. I will spend the coming days in the village of Panam Pahala. Whatever seeks Pele, goddess of fire, holds it with now in my grasp. I will defiantly reach the right place, although I'm weary from travel. I'm too excited to sleep. The villagers are friendly, but warn me of hurting customs. Something I have no intention to do. I also I have also noted the alchemist symbol of fire etched over people's doorway. It connects to Pele, of course, but it's linked to the crest of Sot as well. Alright, um, just wait. I'll be right back. Okay. And I am back. So I'm assuming I have to put all these pages that I found inside the journal now, so. He sure c I should see if I can find the missing pages before. Oh, Pele. He sure could draw. Th oh, Pele. He sure. Oh. I should see if I. I should see if I can find the missing pages before moving. A desk drawer. It's more than four. Could this be one of the diary pages? There's five. Elson, also known as Trollstones, the subject of Scandinavian folklore. Normal rocks with holes in them the size of an acorn were considerably lucky, otherworldly, and useful. Hung from the necks of livestock, it would protect them and their farmers alike from mouscous predators, trolls, and even incubi. In some tales, the owners of True Elson is able to see the otherwise invisible common troll through the hole of the rock. While several of these were on display, only one of them looked to be the one I was looking for, carved in a way that no average jeweler could, and with ore in place of where a hole should be. I didn't, I didn't admire it through the most honest, I didn't acquire it through the most honest means, but no one came to harm, and I'm sure its disappearance will be unnoticed. I do wonder how it'll fit in all of this, though. I study it thoroughly. I should see if I can find the missing pages before moving this. Really? There's more. Okay. Huh. This tin. What could the combination. Okay, Grandpa. I need a clue to unlock this box. So if you're here. Huh. Guess I'll have to work it out myself then. Alright. I was really hoping that would be it. I used to put this on for Grandpa after dinner, and we'd sit and listen to it together. Huh. Alright. I'm going to turn this off. Yeah. Mostly because I, 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 I'm, I'm scared it might be copyrighted, so like... Alright. Well, there's something on this globe. So it's got Egypt. Hawaii. Um... Mountains. Ah, uh, China's four. Cause that one's Egypt. That's China. Pele. And there's something in the back here. Well, that would be in um South America. So. So Hawaii is number one. This would be Hawaii. Pele, Hawaii. Oh, okay. These can be pushed. Okay. But this one's not first. That doesn't seem to be it. No, that's not it. So fuchsia. Ah, shoot. What did the message say again? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, shoot. 
I'm just gonna trial and error this. That's just the kind of person I am. <laughs> I did it. This looks like. Is this a second part of my necklace? This looks like. Is this a second part of my necklace? Oh, it's the thing that the Whoa. grandpa said in his book. Entry number five. Sweet, I got a necklace part. Look through your necklace, press. That's a key? Oh, whoa. B. Serious whoa. Okay. Pixie? Yeah, Pixie. Whoa, fancy key. Other things? I'm assuming the clock. Okay. Yeah, I would I would have to assume the clock. Okay. Now V. Oh wait, the journals. The journal entries. Um so this had the fire and it's a triangle. Yeah? Okay, so this one has to go where the fire is. So it needs to go on 11. So can I like... Aren't... It won't budge. I probably need to select the clock hand somehow. Okay, well, do I have something that has something that color? Okay, I have to wait for them to turn. So water is... Another triangle. Oh, wait, this one is tree. So, wherever the tree is, the tree is at six, so. Okay. Can there I? There is no way I can pick this up. Come to think of it. I don't even know where he got it from. On one of his travels, I guess. Oh, so, wait a second. Can I change that? Aha! I probably need to select the clock. Okay, somehow. so I need a normal triangle now, so... Normal triangle is fire. Fire is 11 o'clock, so... Okay... Yeah? Alright, now I want to figure out that one. So that's good. So there's a water droplet one. Did I already encounter the water droplet? The water droplet's right there. So number two. Ah, oh, okay. Honestly, I wish I could affect how this turns. Oh, I can. You gotta be kidding me. So water is the upside down triangle. I believe water was on eight. Yes. Okay, so then I just need to move that last guy. Not that this one. This button seems to control what clock hand can be moved. So the triangle with the thing on the bottom. Oh, wait, I get it now. Okay, so the trying the one for tree is the triangle with, like, so tip is on the bottom. That's... So you, I should not have moved. Shoot. Alright, you need to be, like... I think it's on two. It might be on... Two. And you need to be on six. Was that it? Did I do it? Whoa, whoa. Um what's happening? No. No, no, no. And like that, I disappeared into ash. What? What happened?
What's going on? That what was happened? the first time I traveled by magic. Pulling at the thread that would unravel my grandfather's mysteries. I so wish he told me sooner. So we could have gone on at least one adventure together. Instead, I went on his adventure. The one that never was. But that is a longer story. For another time. Ooh, I hope there's more games here. That was actually amazing. I really hope there's more. Because I am assuming that's the end, right? Ooh, this game was really, really good. I desperately hope that there's more of these. Oh, that was outstanding. Like, I know I could have, like, figured out that other puzzle on the globe by, like, ch you know, reading at the mid letters or, like, what he said in his note to me, but... I'm just, I'm a trial and error kind of guy. So, either way, if you guys like the video, make sure you leave a like. Subscribe to anybody who's like this. And, as always, I hope you have a great rest of your day. Bye.